know that in just hours, the state education commissioner is likely to put mask mandates in place for the start of school. This will affect all teachers and all students. Previously, it was a town by town decision. But as WBZ's Christina Rex reports, the sweeping decision is not sitting well with all parents. The RECA parents wave for support, asking the town to unmask their kids in school. Um, showing who we are. We're real people. This is impacting families. And I just believe it's a choice and it shouldn't be mandated. But the point is moot now. Thank you. The ayes have it. Early Tuesday, the Education Board gave the commissioner power to implement a statewide mask mandate in all K-12 schools this fall. Under the policy, all students and teachers will wear masks regardless of vaccination status until October 1st. Then the mandate will be lifted for middle and high school students, but only if their school has an 80% vaccination rate. And at that time, unvaccinated kids will still have to mask up. But I personally have a son that cannot wear this mask. The mandate news didn't stop parents from debating the issue at a long school committee meeting in Bill Ricca. Some grateful for a mask mandate for their young unvaccinated kids. The least that can be done to protect them without the ability for them to stay home remotely this year is for everyone to wear a mask. Others saying if the rule is mask up, they're out. I have since pulled her from entering first grade in the town of Florida. There will be some exceptions to this mask mandate, including kids under five years old, as well as any kids with behavioral needs or certain medical conditions. In Bill Ricca, Christina Rex, WBZ News. Christina, thank you.